Hey there, it's Silzy B here again with my Friday video and uh, this time I will tell you about the reason why I became a public speaker. As you know, I am a Latvian immigrant in the United States and one of the reasons why people immigrate or emigrate from their own countries is that they are looking to solve some kind of a problem. Maybe uh, those are financial problems or maybe they are relationship problems, which was my case because I had an established career, but I uh, had a very uh, bad divorce. We didn't uh, divorce in a friendly way and it uh, traumatized me. And uh, then I really, what I did was I moved to another town in Latvia because I simply didn't want to stay in the same town uh, where my ex-husband lived because we both were um, more or less um, publicly known people. People knew me and people knew him. And I wanted to start from a total zero. So I moved to another town. Um, I met uh, my future husband, who is American, and that's the reason why I moved to America. And I'm talking about these relationship issues, which are, when we are in the middle of the crisis, they are very, very painful, and sometimes people think that they don't even want to continue living. However, moving to another country may solve your existing problems for a while, but it doesn't mean that you will get rid of problems. You will always have, have problems. And typically, uh, immigrants to a new country have one big problem. It's getting adjusted to the new situation. And it's not easy. You have to be very proactive. And sometimes it's so hard that you, again, you find yourself in deep depression and maybe sometimes you also want to discontinue living. It can be that hard. I've been there, so it's if it looks that it's uh, I have it all together, that's not the case. Everybody who is posting those beautiful pictures on social media, everybody has problems. But uh, when we go through them, then um, we realize that maybe that was a life lesson to learn. And um, if you are strong enough, you can even make fun of yourself. And that's what I've started doing. I'm making fun of myself and my story about my husband's or ex-husband's. And uh, today I will share a humorous speech that's actually award-winning speech. I will share fragments of it and uh, you'll see what I'm doing right now and maybe that will help uh, some of you to also uh, look at your problems in a different way and maybe even see a humor in it. All right, so uh, enjoy and have a wonderful weekend. When you divorce, your relationship isn't over. What happens is you simply enter a new phase. It's called, look how happy I am without <laughs> you. <laughs> when I was in that phase, I moved to a small tourist town. My heart was still aching. My wounds were still bleeding. But I took a lot of happy looking pictures for him to see on social media. <laughs> and the rock that he gave me was impressive <laughs> and persuasive. <laughs> on the plane I was dreaming about the house, how I will decorate it and fill it with my feminine aura. <laughs> I die. <laughs> All right, darling, let's sit and die. <laughs> Ladies, I am here to help you. I know my mission. I have found three already. <laughs> Listen me out. 
you need to change the bait on your hooks. The one that you are using doesn't work. <laughs>